Wow. Oh, damn. Was a Hydra scientist. Man, y'all kind of late, bro. Homeboys already reached the Watcher's crib. He's in another universe at this point. He's in another dimension. It's another realm. Universe? I'll take that as a yes. Man, this is beyond the U.S. government right now. Y'all need to hurry up. Y'all need Jesus. Mr. Anderson. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't understand Russian. It's a family name. I don't know. I imagine you have many questions. It's a long story. We need your help. <laughs> so you work for whom you want me to infiltrate it from the inside? We did a pretty yes. good number on S.H.I.E.L.D. the same way. I think that my strategic objectives would ever... It's true. <laughs> S.H.I.E.L.D. I... All right. What exactly did you have? Dialing Avengers Tower. Huh. You're having some fun. You know. So, you might <laughs> feel a little poke here. Or not. I don't know. So, our only option is to upload oh, the world. Get a sentry drone. You snap. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, you would not be. Torture. Dang. It's, oh, like, didn't they just burn him? Like, no, he's inside the arrow. <laughs> why, did, why, did they, why, why did they become attracted to it like walkers? <laughs> right? It's like fire. Oh, there you go. Oh! 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 Oh, oh shoot! Hey. Oh, and that's using her dad's shield. If you think about it, she's using her father's shield. What was that for? Mm -hmm. Precaution. Is funny? Yeah, 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 yeah. Tell the HR. <laughs> <laughs> Time check. I connect. Well, that doesn't uh, Dola, better not be messing with us. I assure you, if I had a life to swear on, I would. <laughs> the Ultron Hive <laughs> mine appears to be. I. Dang. Oh, oh shoot. Go, go, go. Bro, we gonna do a lot of arrows though. That's a lot of arrows. I mean, a lot of um things. Oh, oh! Come on now. Oh, that was dope. Man, they really did him so dirty. Mm-hmm. If this was the stuff we were getting. Mm-hmm. They're, they're probably doing this to make people like him more. For yeah. When Hawkeye yeah. dropped. Hi. Oh. Oh. He's actually helping. Bruh. I need you. Like, what? Bro. I swear, oh, it's just... he's gonna use an explosive arrow. Yeah. But he could've did that when he got up. Mm. There was no way to pull him up. Oh, wow. Look at that shot, dude. Dang. Oh. Then where? Mm -hmm. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> yep, he's not supposed to interfere, but now he is. Yeah. Who the boy? Get out of here. Is it interfering if it's in his dimension? Oh. oh but anything. Oh, he already figured out how to interact. Oh, oh, oh shoot! What world is even is this? Oh, oh my, my God! God. Oh, oh. oh. What? Oh my God! The power of my will. Oh my! Oh my! Oh! Yo! 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 Oh my God! Oh my God! Bro! 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 Oh! What is happening? 
Galactus! Was that Galactus? Oh, was that Ultron? Oh my god, I just, yo, I just, <laughs> I just hyped myself up for no reason. Oh, shoot. I thought that was Galactus. I was get, I was about to get hyped. Oh. oh 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 my god oh that's like a whole new meaning to i'm gonna into the next universe <laughs> oh no oh oh Oh. I'm out of options. That thing has left me no choice. <laughs> Been there. Been living the dream alone in a prison of my own making ever since. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I want to hear you say it. Oh, wow. Ah. Cool. I'm so sorry, guys. I should have thought that was Galactus. I was getting crazy. <laughs> I was so hyped because just from the just from do, do you understand why why I thought it was Galactus? You asking me? Yeah. Just at first glance, the shape of the head looked like this mm. around the I planet. What you mean. So I was like, oh wait, what the hell is that Galactus? Yeah, it was like the reddish, but it's like the same color. It was just it was so much just happening, and I'm like, wait, 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 yeah. wait, wait, wait. Did they just yeah, no, bring a lot, Galactus into this? A lot this? was happening at the same time. I like no, it's just Ultron. Y'all, y'all know y'all, y'all know y'all can see why I thought it was Galactus. Like if we go back, to yeah, it, no, like right here. Yeah, no, it looks like you see what I mean. I see what you mean. Like y'all, y'all look, look what, look, look why I saw it. Like at first glance. If you pause it, obviously you, can, obviously you can tell it wasn't Galactus. Yeah, but it's, everything is moving so quickly. But then you look at this picture. You look. You look at the picture. Uh, any picture of Galactus. Mm -hmm. Just you see, like the sides here, like the sides of his head. No, I see what you mean. That's what had me thinking. That's how I was like. And plus, mm -hmm. he like eat worlds and stuff. So like, so it might I'm have like, been like a reference. It could have been a Galactus reference. It literally could have been a Galactus reference. Y'all can't blame me for thinking it was Galactus at first glance. But then when you look at it, they know it's Ultron. Yeah. So I was like, man, what the? I'm like, Galactus, what the heck? Dude. So sorry about that. But um, <laughs> yeah, uh, I was about to stop the video. Oh, that would have been bad. Okay, easily the best episode. Yeah. And then, and oh all of God. them. It's been the craziest episode. Easily the best. Because, like, I didn't even think that, I didn't even think we was going to see the watch a scrap like that. I didn't think no. we were going to see the watch come in. He's the watch. Actually, get involved. Like, what? And he got involved, and this is why yeah. he doesn't get involved because he can stop things. You know what I'm saying? But I would hate to have, make a vow like that and just like see things happen and just yeah. like, oh well, this reality is doomed, and like don't do anything about it. Yeah. No, my prediction is that he's going to get the heroes from the other universes to stop. Yeah. Ultron. Yeah. Because that's the only way. Yeah. yeah. This could be wishful thinking, but the X Men. <laughs> <laughs> right. wishful, I mean, wishful thinking we never know honestly or probably just everyone we've seen so far yeah most likely that would make more sense because of the ensemble yeah man i wish that they would introduce the x-men this way that'd be dope man this is the perfect way to introduce the x-men yeah. in my opinion dude Blue what are they waiting for i'm just like waiting because like you have the property now you have the rights yeah i need to see and like all <laughs> all this stuff are just lawsuits and stuff going on right now Lots of stuff happening, man. Lots of crazy stuff happening right now. Ugh. Dude, this was an episode. It was an episode. This indeed. was an episode, bro. This was an episode. I don't even know what to say. Like, I'm just at like a loss for words. I gotta um. What I all I do know is that I have to take off my uh. I have to take off that noise that noise filter thing, because um, if I if you go too if loud, I yeah, yeah, if I raise be beyond a certain decibel, then it won't pick it up yeah, in the it microphone. So it just out. sounds yeah. like silence. Oh man, but I make a lot of high frequency noises you when, do. I, when I scream. You do, <laughs> but it also so, helps not to like blow the um 
Make well, people's ears out. Well, that's what a that's what a compressor is for. So I mean, if I have mm-hmm. a if I have a compressor on, then that'll just or I yeah. put or I set a, a limiter, which would uh, basically put it to a certain volume, a certain uh, decibel level. Right. It won't go past that decibel level, no matter how loud I scream. So normally I do like a mixture of compression, compression and limiters. Mm-hmm. Um, but this new noise filter, it works good because it keeps uh, it keeps it like sound like all the background noise from coming in. Yeah. It does a pretty good job. It's just that like it really it cuts out certain decibels, so it's right. annoying. But stuff that you want certain frequency mm-hmm. uh, frequency bands. But anyways, yeah. Um, no, nah, this is a fantastic episode. Yeah, no, uh, I didn't think this was gonna get there. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm actually kind of glad that uh, well, Clint died for no reason, but I, I I'm kind of glad yeah, that I think that was kind of like to be like, oh, okay, you guys were upset that Natasha died, so we're just gonna kill Clint. I really think that's what it was, because it was like the same kind of falling. Yeah, I mean, like, um, yeah, it was very similar. Hey, uh, or definitely a reference to that. Yeah. Um, I'm glad that they weren't the one that ended up shutting Ultron down because that no, would have actually looked made me mad, bro. That would have made sense. Like that would have made me so mad, bro. Oh, the savior of the universe. <laughs> <laughs> the savior of the multiverse. Two people without any <laughs> power. People without power. Now, if it was Batman, that's a different story. Mm-hmm. Now, you know, if, if you would tell me Batman's gonna save the multiverse, I believe it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Batman's a different story. Batman's a different story. But an assassin <laughs> and a guy who's good with a bow and arrow. Bro, I ain't gonna lie to you. Recently, they've been making Tony look like... I would say this. Like, if you really look at Tony's career and the whole, like... And, and guys, don't see this as complaining. I'm just comparing. Yeah. If you look at Tony's whole, like, thing in the MCU, like, Tony was dope and stuff. He's done some really cool stuff. He's nowhere as, like, crazy... And powerful as he is in the comic books, obviously mm-hmm. most of them aren't. Mm-hmm. As you know, comic books, comic books, right? Right. Yeah. So you can get away with a lot get away more. with a lot more. You can do a lot more things mm-hmm. in different ways. So Tony, in my opinion, is a lot more cooler in the comic books in terms of like the things he can do and the types of levels. The types of levels that he has. <laughs> Sorry, there was someone like yeah, people working, do some work outside. <laughs> um, um, but yeah, no, uh. But, like, in comparison to Batman, though, I'm sorry, like, Batman, Batman is different. Like, mm-hmm. Batman, you you, you, you can't, okay, I'm just trying, I ain't trying to start a whole war in the comments. I can't say too much, just because the only Batman I've really seen is the, what, two movies? Don't go just out the movies, I mean, well, you haven't seen the animated stuff either. No, I haven't. I've seen him show up in Young Justice once, be like, hey, don't do that. You're not old enough yet. So. I think Batman over Tony Stark. Mm-hmm. To be honest. I can't. Make but which one's a more likable character? Tony. I would say Tony just because you can't not love Tony just because Tony is hilarious. He got yeah. charisma, spunk. You know, he knows how he knows how to lighten a situation up. And, you know, he's, like, he's, he's a very likable character. Oh, we destroyed New York City. Let's go get trauma. <laughs> right. I'm hungry. Bat- <laughs> Batman, you either love him or you love him, but you're irritated by him at the same mm-hmm. time. In a sense that, like, dude, you're so cool, but like, you don't have to be so broody all the time. Yeah. Like, damn, bro. Yeah. And then, but then I do like some of the uh, iterations where they have like, cause there's some, there's so many like moments in the, in the animated movies that you'll get to where like Green Lantern, like Hal Jordan's Green Lantern, is just like constantly picking bat on Batman's and like getting on his nerves mm-hmm. and constantly irritating him to the point where Batman just makes corny stupid dad jokes. Yeah. And he tries to make jokes when he's so serious and like it's so hilarious and like oh, him and great. Green Lantern have this weird relationship that's mm-hmm. so hilarious. So there's like different moments where Batman has his moments where he just makes stupid dad jokes or like yeah. moments where where he's trying to get closer to Damien by being a good dad and it's just and, like being like doing fathery things and it's just really like awkward and Damien mm-hmm. is just like really like really you gonna try to do this right now yeah like grow up like <laughs> Damien, Damien was just like really woo father of the year grow a pair dad <laughs> I have not seen much of him but I already know he's a little little soft <laughs> anyway taking it back to what if yeah yeah no that was a really good really good episode um yeah no I I Man, that was insane. 
you, you, yo, you managed to split Thanos. Yeah. <laughs> like it was nothing. Like it was nothing, dude. Like he didn't have <laughs> he didn't have the infinity stones. No. Like No, he if, if, you know, he had he had the mind stone. Well the mind stone, obviously, but I'm saying like all of them. But if he can do that with just the mind stone. I think he just Bro, that's all they have to do. But all of them are but that shows you the difference between them and like um, Vi and like Vision, Ultron, because yeah. Ultron's an AI, right? He's not having empathy, compassion. He does not care. Right. This person has what I want. Ooh, split in two. Whereas the Avengers are trying to find every other, because killing is the easy way. If but you really think about it, it is. It really is. It's the easier option. It, all, it always is the easiest option in these situations. But, it, you know, depending on who you are and if you have a moral compass or not, it is either that will affect you or will be nothing to you. Yeah. And obviously, to an emotionless a being as an Ultron, He's like just programmed, programmed, like he doesn't understand the feeling of loneliness. He doesn't have. It's a confusing thing for him to process. So yeah. for him, like just not being alone is just weird, in a in a, yeah, in a way was, that doesn't compute. To, he was like know. about to be depressed that he was like, well. I destroyed everything. What you know, do I do now? He better just go start this. Sh well, if there's, you see, here's the thing: if there's infinite universes, he'll never be out of work. Yeah. Well. <laughs> if, 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 if infinite universes, he'll never be out of work. You know that's what I'm saying? True. So that's why he's like, destroy all the universes, right? That's why he's like, oh man, like I found everything now. Time to think, and like you just see him like using the. The Infinity Stones to just like make to reshape himself in so many different yeah. ways. I just thought of something so stupid. What? What if he destroys like all of the universes? Mm -hmm. But there's just one he leaves, but just gets rid of all the people and just runs like a coffee shop. <laughs> <laughs> just has like the other, um, the other. <laughs> this is my coffee <laughs> shop. Just going there, he's like, "Well, I got nothing else to do. I hear this is what humans did." Yeah, right. This is what humans did. I'm bored. <laughs> I'm just imagining sure him in a little Starbucks hat and the, <laughs> the apron. Yeah, and he grows, and he grows a, a barista mustache. <laughs> <laughs> it, but he doesn't grow it; it's metal. Yeah, it's metal, and he has a um, he has a. Look, uh, I keep forgetting those things, man. The um. Man, what are they called? What? Glasses things. A monocle? Monocle, yeah. He has a monocle. Because <laughs> he's, cause he's, um, cause he's retro. Yeah. Yeah. He just, like, saw it in a magazine. Like, yeah. Like, it was like, hmm. I think I would like that. Manifest a, a, a monocle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, um, no, no. You know exactly what he would look like, mm -hmm. as you said. Well, don't look. <laughs> look now. <laughs> He's gonna look like Bob oh, from Overwatch. Gosh. That's amazing. He would look like Bob. Oh. He'd look like Bob from oh, Overwatch. Bob. You wanna what if he went through like phases and then he just looks like Division? <laughs> I remember Division. Oh, <laughs> See that one? It's one of Division and the baby. It's the vision, but it's the baby face on it. I love that. Oh my god. The vision. <laughs> y'all need to stop, but it's the vision. Oh my, the baby division. Oh, y'all is so corny. Oh my god. That's oh my amazing. god. Oh my god. Anyways, uh, Let's go look up the things that we just talked about. We're gonna end up. We're gonna end this video, but that was a great episode, fantastic yes. episode. Loved it, absolutely amazing, enjoyable, and um, Next just a ton of fun, gonna man. Be crazy. Yeah, it's gonna be crazy. We'll see how they wrap this one up. But this is great. I mean, you know, just seeing the Watcher get in there and Ultron, it just shows what kind of a force he would have been if they actually gave him the stones. Yeah. If, they were, if they actually had the, if they had the temerity to do it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. If they actually had, you know, the the, the strength to do it, that would have been crazy, man. So like, yeah, no, this is gonna it's gonna be interesting. Yeah, I feel like the, like animate is the best way to like do this. Whole oh thing. yeah, oh yeah, that's insane. Can you imagine the budget for that? Yeah, that would have been insane, dude. That would have been more expensive than oh, the game. I think. Oh, with CGI and everything, oh, it would yeah, be like ninety percent CGI. 
I'm like, hold up. I'm like, I'm thinking like, how did you like have Captain Marvel should go to the core of a planet with him, mm-hmm. and then the, the 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 saviors of the universe are Clinton and 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 yeah. and Natasha. I'm sorry. <laughs> I like no love y'all and all, but no, no, it just doesn't make sense. No, it does not. Um, but I think it's just an appropriate spot to end the video, guys. Yeah. Um, we're going to continue this conversation. This is a great episode. Can't wait to get it up for you guys to see. Can't wait to hear your comments and your thoughts down below. Amazing, amazing, amazing episode. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah, man, we'll, we'll, we'll continue to talk about this later, um, in, uh, the finale. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to check out part one. Link is down below and we'll see you in the next one. Clockmaster and Cosmic Thanks. Out.